Athi River, a hub for industry on the outskirts of Nairobi. It's growing fast, but the infrastructure is barely keeping up. One of the very challenging uh, things is, is water, because people used to get water from the, uh, the river nearby, or the dams, or sometimes they, they use donkeys and they sell water to people, and people don't even know where the water is coming from. Enter Grundfos, the Danish firm turned their know-how making high-quality pumps around the world to a local solution a water station powered by solar energy. In 2008, Grunfos made a strategic decision to enter into the base of the pyramid. We have poor people who need some solutions, especially with water, and us being a leader in that field, we decided to come up with some solutions. They created a novelty in these parts, a water station that actually works. This is what we call the water dispenser. So it has several slots. So like this one has a three tap, and you can check your balance. And here's the main innovation a prepaid system that allows users to load their tokens using mobile money and fill up at the station. When you want to top up your water credit, you go to the pay bill, you'll get a notification from M-Pesa, then you, you take the key form, put it in the key slot, you'll see water now coming out. To stop the water flowing, I'll just remove the key form. It'll basically dispense a liter and it stops. So you can load as many times as you want, you can fetch water as much as you want, so long as you have money to pay for it. The mode of payment is free from corruption because there is no terms of cash and it's cheaper compared to the other water. For a jerry can 20 liters, it costs three shillings. 6,000 liters are pumped here a day, benefiting 2,500 local people. I use the water for washing, cooking and bath. Sometimes we used to buy water that we don't know whether it's clean, but this one is very clean because you get it from here, you see where the water is coming from. Waterborne diseases have gone down because now they are, at least they're using safe water. A locally elected water committee ensures that it is owned and managed by the community. I'm the village manager of this area. Also, I'm the caretaker of this project. You have to have a well-functioning water committee because they, they'll be like the custodian of the project. Athi River is one of 40 similar pilots in Kenya. Just one example of mobile money making utilities and services more accessible, or what some people call Digital Finance Plus. You're going to see many water companies embracing prepayments because they have a, bad, a lot of bad debts. And I think going forward, you're going to see people embracing that technology. The population is growing and the demand for water is going high every day. The resources that is being used to pump the water, which is the sun, is sustainable, it's reliable, it's something that you are sure that is going to be there tomorrow.